Hello. In this video, I'd like to share an overview of what you will learn in MESA's Inventor Tube and Pipe Modeling class. One of the first things you'll learn about is the structure of a tube and pipe model, where you have a tube and pipe run subassembly, runs, and then routes below that. You'll also learn how styles determine what fittings and conduit is used in a specific route. An example here, right now we're using a black flexible hose. If I jump into the right level here, I can switch the style out for a 5 16 blue. And you'll see it will change the size, the fittings, and the conduit being used. You'll also learn how to sketch out routes for, for the piping. So I'm going to turn on a work plane here. And then I'm going to create a route. I can type in sizes of how far I want to go in specific directions. You can see in the newer versions of the software, it actually populates the fittings as it, as it goes. There's also additional things like point snaps and things like that that we can turn on that allow us to snap to certain types of objects. And there is a route that has all the right fittings. So really just by creating a sketch of single lines, the style tells it what types of fittings to use and what type of conduit, and it creates the piping style for me based off those styles. We'll also spend a lot of time talking about authoring and publishing components that basically allow us to easily snap components into place. Using place fitting, I can take a piece that has already been authored and it will just kind of snap into line here, creating the appropriate breaks in that line segment where the fitting needs to be. We can also take that to the next step and publish those types of parts to the content center. So here's a custom component that we would be authoring. I can pick a size and because this is a valve, it's open or closed. And then again, once I get close to line, you'll see that it'll snap. I can then rotate it to the appropriate position. And basically because these uh, part of the authoring process is to determine connections, it'll also break that line in the appropriate spot to then connect to that fitting appropriately. All this and more is covered in Mesa's tube and pipe modeling class. If you'd like to sign up, feel free to give us a call or you can email me directly. There's also links in the description to this video to our full course catalog and course schedule.